the congregation of a Clifton church showed up to worship on Sunday, there were some unwelcome messages waiting for the group. The church was the target of a vandal. As Angela Ingram shows us, it's the latest in a series of hateful messages in roughly the same area. A stunning piece of art glass put Clifton United Methodist Church on the National Register of Historic Places. But recent monikers of hate added the church to a growing list of places targeted with vandalism. We arrived on Sunday morning to discover that our sign had been defaced um, with um, sexual slurs uh, and vandalism. Last month, a swastika was carved into one of the restrooms. Pastor David Meredith says it showed up after the church put out signs promoting inclusion of refugees. And there's another message etched into a stall of the men's room. It is tragic when anyone feels so badly about themselves that to make them feel, themselves feel better, they need to beat up somebody else. The church is just one of several places of worship that has been targeted. Hebrew Union College was vandalized with swastikas. Threats have been made against the Clifton Mosque. And Withrow High, a predominantly black school, was vandalized with swastikas and racial slurs. Hebrew Union College is just two blocks up the hill. The Clifton Mosque, where they receive threats every day, is just a block down the hill from us. There's something wrong going on when the air and the water we breathe says this is acceptable behavior. This church is known for activism and speaking out for equality of women, minority and the LBGTQ communities. Pastor David says the vandalism says more about the perpetrator than it does about the groups targeted. So my heart is very sad for the folks who would feel that this is a good solution for their own brokenness because it's not. And that's Angela Ingram reporting. The church is planning a gathering around the sign that was vandalized tomorrow night. It's at 530 and it's a show of solidarity and a reminder to the congregation that they will continue to promote equality of all people.